So I like to transport someone out of the present situation, bring them into present time by looking at something that, you know, catches their eye, but also catches your mind. Ask anyone who creates and you'll quickly discover their outlet. I feel like I'm just a conduit, you know, I'm just letting it flow. Electric or eclectic, Efren Palermo loves to share. Can I show you something? Can I go get it? A handyman by trade, Efren frames his art to be outside the box. How can I say, I also consider myself a citizen scientist. That's a biology piece I did that's actually a cell structure. Uh, it has parts of a cell like the nucleus, mitochondria, uh, endoplasmic reticulum, you know, things you might remember from high school biology, right? He calls his style fantastical and everything has a theme. Karate, mushrooms, and he says from now on, all his work will have a hint of the times. It's very time consuming, but I think it's, uh, uh, it comes out all right. Bending thin layers of wood is how all of these colorful pieces begin. When the frame is finished, he fills it with plaster, carves it out, and paints. I'm going to show how from the very beginning, from the idea that I had, and how I evolved into the, these other pieces. With art shows and festivals canceled, Efren wants to bring a little slice of life to his corner of the neighborhood. I just want to give a little bit of something that's outdoors. You know, it's kind of just throw some art out there. This weekend, in front of his home on Boise Street, he's turning the sidewalk into an outdoor art gallery. There's some art in the world. You know, there's some positivity. There's some, there's some, some love, you know what I'm saying? There's creativity. Creativity he wants others to see, to enjoy, and embrace our own delicate process. Even actually, what happens is that uh, in some of these cases, uh, things break. Uh, actually break in half or totally destroyed. But I just keep, I actually use the breakage as part of the work. You know, yeah, they break, but... How do I put it back together? And I think that's actually a lesson in life as well, you know, because life is hard. What do you do when things happen? Things always happen. You know, do you throw it away or, or do you actually use that, you know, that, that whatever, that scar tissue, whatever it is to enhance your next, the next phase. In Southeast Portland, John Goodwin, KGW News.